everyone welcome back to my channel so today video I have a little guest here is my son Alex and we're gonna do a video about how I stopped breastfeeding yes so this little guy a little guy today is one year and seven months and that's it he's a big boy he's not anymore um, eating uh, mommy milk and he's eating like food uh, exclusively so I decided to stop breastfeeding and like start in winning him when uh, he was one year and a half so I wanted to breastfeed and he till uh, two years but uh, he started like uh, becoming more nervous he was crying more uh, and he was coming a lot of times during the during the day and also during the night he was waking up a lot just to breastfeed just like for some seconds so I was looking that he's not indep independent at all he wanted just um, just like a, a thing yes you're smiling he just wanted to come and uh, just a eat a little bit and sometimes he was getting angry on me so one day I decided to ask the pediatrician how is a better way to start weaning your baby she told me a way like um, the longer way when you like prepare the baby and yourself too and uh, Alex uh, was not eating uh, like uh, um, so much like a lot just like some 30 seconds just like he was the breastfeeding so I decided to go with the short way with the cold turkey I didn't uh, like uh, listen to the doctor the thing is that some moms they choose that uh, like um, more like longer way of doing this uh, they say it's better for the baby they like getting ready for the baby but I saw that Alex uh, was hard for him even Yes, hi. I was telling him like, um, hi, hi, yes. Uh, okay, so I was like uh, trying to think which one was gonna be better for us hi. both. Hi, yay. Hi. Okay, so I decided to try which one was gonna be better for us. So the longest part, uh, I decided to go hi. with the hi. <laughs> so I decided to go with the cold turkey. I know it's like a little bit harsh for the baby, but hi, all my yeah, mom, like my mom and my aunts, they did this, hi. and so my mom already lost. So I tried to do the same um, method hi. of winning. Hi, hello, I'm Alexandro. Yes. Okay, give mommy a kiss. So I decided to go with the cold turkey. Uh, the first uh, day I gave him the last uh, time I breastfeed him at 11 o'clock and then I took like a bra, um, sport bra, something like uh, like too strong to support my breast and that's it. I didn't give him any more. Yes. So I start giving him like yogurt. I start giving him buy, not buy, not buy. I start giving him like all this food that he likes, yogurt, a milk, I warm him whole milk. by gilly gilly? Okay. And also like the food that he likes, the fruit, uh, bananas, which one, the strawberry, like grapes. So I give him also like soup and he was like, he eat. The problem was how I'm gonna make him sleep, like his naps. Mm. So usually he was uh, used to sleep uh, with the like while breastfeeding. So I uh, I give him uh, just like some uh, whole milk in the bottle and not the bottle with like dipple. I give him with the sipping cup. Yeah, I'm gonna say sipping cup. Yes, hi. So he drink the sipping cup milk and then I just hold him like this and I try to make him sleep. So. He cried a little bit before sleep, but he fell asleep because it was hard for him for the first time not to sleep with um, milk, like mommy. And then, until the night, I tried to play with him, to not think about that. Uh, so he was a good boy, he was not like uh, acting like he wants something. The only thing he started in the night. So in the night he started uh, like thinking already it's time for him to breastfeed. 
to eat milk. So I give him the whole meal the same uh, in the sippy cup. He yes, hi, hi, Jeffanch, you okay? So he eat the breast, uh, the sippy cup meal, and then he start crying because he wanted to to the mommy. So uh, I was thinking maybe my husband will gonna try to make him sleep so we're gonna have any problems and um, he start crying more so i decided to hold him like to try to take him like this to my arms and even he cried but he fell asleep in the night he woke up like two times the same a little bit crying but i tried to make him sleep so it was a little bit hard but we got through the night he didn't cry as much as i was thinking that he's gonna cry but he he was a little bit upset with me of course after one year and a half he got used to my milk so of course he was upset and um after that we uh, i decided to like uh, give him every day the same breakfast like to give him more snacks for him to not feel hungry and not to remember that he wants uh, the milk so the second day during the day was the same like really good he eat he didn't remember like too much i think like two times he was just coming and like trying to say and i was telling him like no i explained to him no mommy no we, we are, you're a good boy you're a big boy and he didn't want it more then in the night the problem with the sleeping hi <laughs> In the night was a problem with the sleeping, so as he was a little bit upset, he didn't want the sippy cup, but he drank a little bit and then the same. I was holding him in my arm and he fell asleep. So he fell asleep like these three days in my arms and then the fourth day, that's it. He wanted to sleep alone on the bed. So after that, uh, it's already like almost two, two weeks. It's two weeks. So. My son is sleeping all through the night. I'm so happy. He's not waking up. He's uh, sleeping good, uh, no crying. Also, he's eating okay. Uh, he's not eating so much like food, but he's still eating. I think it's like a period of transition from uh, like breast milk and now he's gonna eat only food and it's okay. The part with me is that how I got through this part, it's a different other subject because yes 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 hi hi so the problem was me after i uh, stopped cold turkey my breast got like big and engorged and it was like a little bit pain but about this i'm gonna talk my next video yes bye let's say bye so alexander is a good boy he's not anymore breastfeeding so this experience was um a new one for me because first time mom you don't know what to how to oh no how to like stop and how to treat how to it's like something new and also emotional when you stop breastfeeding and you don't know what to do but gladly it was okay for us both to and we got through this yes and now i think that was a good choice because my son is more independent and he's like happy first he's sleeping all through the night before he was waking up two three times while he was breastfeeding and now he's like sleeping good during that day he's having nap time too and also i can go somewhere like uh, he can stay with his uh, grandma and we don't have any problems he's not crying so that was a really nice thing to do um okay yes okay let's say bye thank you so much guys uh, my next video i'm gonna talk uh, how i um, got through stopping breastfeeding how i heal my breasts and i'm gonna tell you all about my experience say bye bye thank you so much for uh, watching us and see you next video.